ladies and gentlemen, we're about to witness the basketball battle of the century. The whole town has turned out to back the local team from University U, and Polytechnic University from upstate is well supported too. The UUPU rivalry dates back to the beginning of the century, and up to now, the score is even, and tonight's battle is a toss up between these two squads. Here comes the home squad out on the floor. Just listen to that crowd. And here comes the visiting team. Hooray! The teams are out there warming up now, and it won't be long before we get underway. Basketball attracts the tall boys, whose great height makes it easy for them to drop the ball through the hook. These last minute practice shots are very important to the boys. They like to have their eyes sharp enough for that old bucket. All right, we're ready to go here now. It's a tense moment. The players are anxiously awaiting the outcome of the first toss. Polytechnic coach is giving last minute instructions to his star player. The referee is picking up the ball. Now both squads are on the court. They line up for the jump. All oh, the tension is terrific. The ball is tipped. Banta has it, pivoting. He bounces the ball to West, who dribbles and passes to Hannah. Hannah tosses back to West, West to Hannah, back to West, to Hannah, to West, to Hannah, to West. The ball's to bat in the pivot spot. Back to West, waiting for an opening. To Reeves, to Huber, over to... Oh, there's the break. Reeves dribbling the ball past the defense, under the basket. He shoots. It's good. Two points, and the home team draws first blood. Wright takes it out of bounds, flips it to Matt, over to Reeves again in the pivot position, over to Gracie, to Bird, to Feed. The sharp eyes of the referee sometimes catch things the spectators miss. So let's retrace that last play and view it through the referee's eye. Sibley dribbling. They guard him closely. <laughs> And he passes to right. West has it, dribbling down court. Look at that footwork. Satter White gets one free throw. It's up to the referee to make sure that the thrower's feet do not overlap the free throw line. And he makes the point. King tosses into Sibley, who dribbles down court across the center line, pivots and passes to Tobelman in position. And he's, no, Hagen has the ball. He shoots. It's blocked. No, it's, 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 no, no, it's, it's no good. Yes, it's good. What teamwork. The ball's into Murray, who dribbles past the offensive man. There's a long pass. Gracie has it. He dribbles in and shoots. It's good. Reeves tosses the long one down to Hannah, to West, back to, no, it's intercepted. A shot from the side and good. There's another basket, another and another. They're on the university's basket now. Hannah shoots, good. Reeves shoots, good. There's another shot, and another, and another, and another. All good, and it's tipped in, and that's good, too. Wright has it, dribbling down the sidelines. He's in the clear. Hell ball. These UU boys are really on their toes. Reeves takes the ball, dribbles into his front court. Wow, Bird ties him up. But he gets it away, it's in. Right into Berg, over to Gracie, back to right. Hannah to Reeves, over the center, into West, to Banta, to Satterwhite. And there's the gun ending the first half. The teams are going to the dressing room for that well-earned rest. All set to go again. UU has a four-point lead as we go into the second half. All right, Brightman gets the ball. He gets to the defense, in the clear, and on his way. The ball's tossed into Kinney. No, it's intercepted by West. What a play. He's in the clear. Hold it. Something's wrong. And Berg leaves the game. This is a real blow to the coach. Number 17, Patton, goes in. The ball's in play. The defense closes in. Another PU man out on foul. The coach looks worried. He's losing a lot of good men. Two more men going in. There goes another one. And another. The coach is in a tough spot. Reports to the referee. All 
12 seconds to go again. Gracie takes the ball out of bounds. His men are covered. What a battle we're witnessing tonight. The score is UU 35, PU 34 with only one minute to go. The ball is in the bat. It's passed to Gracie, to Frazier, over to Kinney. Pivots over to Reed. Back to, and there's the break. There's a shot. Another. Murray takes it off the backboard. There's a battle going on under UU's basket. Oh, right. Takes it off the backboard. They're down the court. Wow, what a mix-up. They're really fighting now. Only 30 seconds left in the ball game, and the crowd is wild. The scramble under UU's basket, and of the bat. West shoots, another, 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 no good, another, another, not good, another, and it's in. And the old ball game, no, no, it's not. Yes, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes. Wow, what a beautiful defense. He's open for a shot, this might be it. Seconds are rapidly disappearing. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Marathu shoots, and, and, and he's in. I mean, it's in. Yes, yes, and there's the final gun. PU 36, UU 35. The upstate boys really came through, and just listen to those PU fans. Hail to victory for all.